we're at this dope event now with oh, a yeah. ton of models. It's got a celebrity feel to it. Yeah. What's the coolest celebrity interaction you've had since your modeling career oh, took off? Oh shit. I mean, I met. Okay, so I, I, I'm even like friends with hella celebrities, but the coolest celebrity I met, I met um, Spike Lee. Okay. Yeah, I met Spike Lee at like a like a suitcase event during like last fashion week. Uh, yeah, that shit was fire. I took a picture with him. And shit. He told me I was the one. He's got to um, bring you to yeah, a next game. Yeah, now he got to bring me to a next game. That's just cra that's just crazy. I met. Uh, yeah, definitely Spike Lee. I met so many like celebrities though. Like, you know, I'm even like my friend. All of my friends over there, like. They're even, you know, they're celebrities, goddamn. But uh, I, Spike Lee takes the cake for sure. <laughs> I've been meeting so many celebrities, man. I can't even like call them back. You know what I'm saying? It'd be so fast out here that like you just be like, oh, celebrities, regular people. You know what I'm saying? It's just people be like gassing them up and shit. It's a regular person, though. Hey, someday soon, celebrities gonna run into you, and then they're gonna answer that, that question. And be exactly, like, exactly. Michael Sandboy. <laughs> exactly. Be like, it was Michael Sandboy. Hell yeah. yeah. I definitely wanted to switch gears and ask about your music. I think my favorite line of yours is, I ain't had no bread, I had to go hunt. Oh, uh, yeah. Because to me, I had no bread, had to go hunt. I kind of picture you in this like Zelda outfit, like going <laughs> through the forest looking for like a loaf of bread. That's hard. But the, uh, a full Rick, full Rick Owen Zelda fit. Yeah, you know, it's interesting because you easily could have said something like, you know, I was broke, I had to go get more money, but yeah. you kind of gave it this creative, kind of quirky spin to yeah. it. How do your lyrics sort of, you know, how'd you paint it like that? I, I mean, so basically, let me, I, I ain't had no bread, had to go, huh? I mean, bro, basically, I just be like, bitch, I'm in this, I just be trying to rap. Okay, so I, I gotta like, sometimes, sometimes I'll be slow on the, on the process when I'm making songs. I gotta live life a little bit, you know? So when the, when you hear them lyrics start coming out, I ain't had no bread, had to go hunt. Bitch, I'm in the city and my phone bumping. Like that's a whole like you know, I was go I was slow for a while. Feel me? I I have to live I have to live like these experiences before I can even make a song. Real shit, I gotta go out, go to the club, do this, do that. You know, run into people uh, and just go through things before I can say these shit. But I definitely have a clever wordplay. I definitely to hold that close to my heart. I would say on a similar note, to me, your music's almost the opposite of macho music. It's more like yeah. innocent and shy and like sort of warm. Yeah, and that's like, shout out to the Shy Boys, for real. That's, um, I, bro, that's what's like where we come from. Lewiston, like me and my homies, bro, we're not like trying to be like, uh, we're not like trying to portray anything. Not like, you know, we're just be ourselves. That's just like the number one thing that you could do in this life, just be yourself. That shit you hear from me, bro, is like, I barely listen to other music. I love Chief Key, you know what I'm saying? But I barely listen to other music. So my bars, like my flow and everything, that's really just me. I be quick with songs too. I make songs in like 10 minutes. I'll sit here right now and make a song on Band Lab, like, and so fast, you know? So you mentioned the Shy Boys. How does recording kind of help you get out of your shell? I mean, like, sometimes, bro, I just be in my room, like, I just want to record sometimes when I'm bored. Like, it, it don't even be like about, I'm already out of my show. Like, like there's no show. This I don't got a show. I, ha I had a show, but I don't have a show no more. Like, I'm, I just, when, when I record, that shit just helps me like just chill, you know? I mean, chilling is not the word for it. I be fucking sweating when I record, but yeah. I just be like sitting down, bro, chill in my room, feel me? Like, just get on, make, get on a song. I don't be like, it, it don't be like if I'm going through something, you know, I need to make a song right now. Uh, I just like will feel it in the moment. I could be like, I was smoking a blunt and then like, the blunt hit me too hard. Yeah, I would make a song about that shit. Like, if I'm just in my room, like, yeah, you know. Yeah. So, if, if Chief Keef's one of your favorite artists, what, yeah. what are your thoughts on Almighty So too? That shit go hard. One, two, three. Uh, yeah, the, all them songs go hard. So I've been listening to that shit. The Dirty Nacho shit he just dropped before. That shit go hard. I love Chief Keef, bro. Like, for everyone knows, I fuck with. I love Chief Keef since a little boy. Like, yeah, I love Chief Keef. One of my favorite songs by you, "I'm Not a Toy." Yeah, yeah. You know, you say, uh, "I'm not a toy." It's my heart I kill for it. Oh God. The romantic heartbreaks you've had in the past. How has that influenced you know the yeah. music you make today? I mean, bro. So that's that's one thing. I guess like um. I always find myself, bro, rapping about bitches, bro. Like, it's crazy, but I guess it's like, it's kind of easy to just like, well, you know, bro, it's good to be like, to be in tune with your emotions and shit, bro. So, uh, whether the fuck I'm feeling horny, I'm feeling sad, bro, I'm gonna put that on a song, bro, like, at all times, bro. But it's just, it's good to be open, bro, you know what I'm saying? It's good to feel 
your emotions, and being able to rap, you know what I'm saying, and have a good beat selection, it makes it, that's it, it makes it easier to express myself, you know, that's all. So, the bitches though, you know what I'm saying, uh, they be good bitches, they be bad bitches that I've had, but I mean, they all influence the music in a good way though, you know what I'm saying. Even if she, she cheated on me, 